Hello and welcome to this Dr. Ross Maths key skill video on drawing a horizontal line to find approximate solutions to an equation. Now if we're trying to solve this equation here, we want to solve 2x squared plus x minus 2 equals 4, you might already know a variety of techniques to solve it. You could move the 4 to one side so we have 2x squared plus x minus 6 equals 0 and then you could either factorise or use the quadratic formula to solve this. However, this question is specifically asking us to use a graphical technique by which I mean we're using a graph to approximate the solution. And let me explain the general method. You would first start with the equation you're trying to solve. You would secondly manipulate the equation until you see the graph equation on one side. I'll explain that in a second. Then you sketch each side of the equation. So you sketch y equals the left-hand side and y equals the right-hand side of your equation. And then you read off the points of intersection. So let's use these steps to solve this. We've got the graph of this, y equals 2x squared plus x minus 2. And we want to use a suitable line to solve 2x squared plus x minus 2 equals 4. Well, let's start using step 1 with the equation we're solving. So we're starting with 2x squared plus x minus 2 equals 4. What's step 2? Manipulate the equation until you see the graph equation on one side. Well, the graph equation, or really mean the graph expression, is 2x squared plus x minus 2. That's the expression we're graphing. Now, we already have that on one side of the equation, so we don't need to do step two, but in subsequent videos, we'll look at harder questions where you would have to do something in step two. Next, we need to sketch y equals the left-hand side, so we're gonna sketch y equals 2x squared plus x minus two, and we're gonna sketch y equals the right-hand side, so we're gonna sketch y equals four. Now, we've already got a sketch of y equals 2x squared plus x minus 2. It's this thing here. They've conveniently done for us. So we just need to sketch y equals 4. Now, remember, y equals 4 is a horizontal line which cuts the y-axis at 4. So if we do that, we can see it's going to cut this curve at two points. So now we just need to do the last step, which is to read off the points of intersection. We can see these are intersecting these two lines here and here. So if we read the values of x off, because remember, we're just solving an equation in terms of x. We don't care about the y value. We just care about the x value. So x here, I'd say, is maybe 1.5. x is approximately equal to, that's approximately equal to, symbol, 1.5. Or x, I'd say that's minus 2. So minus 2 at this second point of intersection. And in fact, if I was to solve this equation exactly, so I can use the quadratic solver on my calculator, it turns out that the exact solutions are in fact 1.5 and minus 2. Ordinarily with these kind of questions, it would be some kind of decimal, and we're just kind of giving an approximate value based on the value of x we read off the graph.